at the Cadex 2024 exhibition, Hante WIA unveiled its latest innovation in mobility and theory, a lightweight 105mm self-propel gun mounted on the Korea Light Tactical Vehicle KLTV. This new system is designed to provide rapid fire support for light infantry brigades and airborne units offering mobility, flexibility, and enhanced firepower to complement South Korea's broader military capabilities. Optimized for fast deployment and shoot and scoot operations, this anti-array system is a testament to Hyundai's focus on creating agile and efficient military platforms for modern battlefield. The 105mm SPG is centered on three key vehicles that work in unison, the fire command vehicle, the artillery vehicle, and the ammunition vehicle, all based on variants of Korea's light tactical vehicle. Together, these vehicles form a comprehensive fire support system capable of autonomous operation, rapid deployment, and coordinated firepower. Fire Command Vehicle K152 is the nerve center of the system, coordinating fire missions and ensuring smooth communication between all units. Equipped with the Battery Tactical Command System and Battalion Command and Control System, it calculates firing data and transmits orders to artillery team. Powered by a 225 horsepower engine, the K152 is highly mobile with a range of 400 km. Its ability to process firing data rapidly enhances mission responsiveness, particularly in fast moving, high stakes operations. The anterior vehicle armed with the KH-175 105mm gun is designed for precision and efficiency. With a 37 caliber bearer and a hydraulic pneumatic recoil mechanism, the vehicle can deliver a sustained rate of fire, launching up to 10 rounds per minute. It boasts a range of up to 14.7 km with standard ammunition and can extend its reach to 18 km using rocket-assisted projectiles. Automated fire control is achieved through GPS and initial navigation system, enabling accurate and swift targeting. The gun can traverse 270 degrees and has an elevation range of minus 5 to 65 degrees, giving it significant tactical flexibility. To ensure sustained fire during operations, the ammunition vehicle plays a crucial role by transporting and loading 105mm rounds, sharing the same mobility characteristics as the other vehicles in the system. It enhances the overall logistic efficiency and ensures the artillery can remain operational in extended engagements. The lightweight Guerre 105mm SPG is specifically designed to support light infantry and airborne units. These forces often operate in challenging terrains where conventional heavy artillery is impractical. The system's mobility allows it to deploy quickly and reposition after firing a vital capability in modern shoot and scoot tactics, reducing its vulnerability to counter-battery fire. One of the standout features of the 105mm SPG system is its air transportability. This system can be transported by helicopters, making it an ideal asset for airborne operations or rapid deployment scenarios where mobility and quick response times are critical. Whether responding to threats in mountainous regions, 
forested areas or urban environments. The 105 meter SPG's compact size and lightweight design offer unparalleled flexibility for modern military operations. Another key advantage of the Hyundai 105mm SPG is its low personal requirement. With only four crew members required for battery command and four for anterior operations, the system is optimized for efficiency. Automation in fire control and communication systems reduces the workload on personnel, allowing faster mission execution and enabling smaller, more agile units to deliver significant firepower. This is particularly beneficial for nations seeking to maximize the effectiveness of their forces without the large manpower footprint. Hyundai's 105mm SPG has strong export potential, particularly in regions where mobility, rapid deployment, and ease of use are high priorities. Nations with significant airborne and light infantry components, or those that operate in difficult terrain, may find this system highly appealing. Additionally, countries with limited defense versions could benefit from the system's cost-effective design compared to heavier more complex and theory platforms. Potential buyers could include nations in Southeast Asia, the Middle East, and Africa, where the demand for lightweight, highly mobile and theory systems is growing. The system's capacity to support quick response operations also makes it a valuable asset for peacekeeping missions counter-insurgency operations, and border security. <laughs>